In this video, I'm going to show you how to upgrade your current PS Plus subscription to the all-new PlayStation Plus Extra or Premium memberships. You'll also learn how to easily change, manage, or even cancel automatic renewals on your subscription. But don't buy PS Premium just yet, because I'm also going to be giving away some PS Plus access codes that you can redeem in the PlayStation Store. So make sure to leave a like rating on the video, and we'll go ahead and get started. Getting a PS Plus subscription is very easy, and can be purchased directly from the online PlayStation Store using debit, credit, or PayPal. You can also use gift cards or vouchers purchased either online or directly from a retail store and redeem them using the scratch off access codes on the back. To do this, go to your user accounts, select payments and subscriptions, and choose redeem codes. Here you can redeem any selection of PlayStation Store gift cards or vouchers. If using a PS Plus voucher has been your preferred way to purchase your subscription in the past, I would highly recommend switching to gift cards or direct online purchase moving forward. Reason is because if you plan on getting the PS Extra or Premium service, a 3 month month membership voucher, for example, will not get you a full three months of PS Extra or PS Premium. Here's an easy conversion table showing exactly how many days of each PS Plus service that you can get when using either a 1, 3, or 12 month membership voucher. And as I promised, here's some complimentary PS Plus access codes for the first five lucky people that watch this video. The all new PS Plus subscription service is now broken down into three separate tiers. You have Essential, which is basically the standard PS Plus service with all the original benefits like monthly monthly games and online multiplayer, PS Extra, which gives you everything in the essential tier, plus the inclusion of the PlayStation Plus games catalog, which gives you access to a full library of PS4 and PS5 games. Then you have PS Premium, which includes everything that you get with Essential and Extra, but also the inclusion of free exclusive game trials, a full catalog of classic PS1, PS2, PS3, PlayStation Portable, and remastered games, along with the ability to cloud stream games directly to your PS4, PS5 or PC. So now that you know the benefits of all three PS Plus services, it's time to choose a subscription. For most users, I actually recommend starting with PS Extra, and if you want the additional services, you can upgrade to Premium by simply paying the $3 difference. Managing your PS Plus membership is also very easy, and you can upgrade or downgrade your service at any time using the payment and subscription settings. Select the Change Plan option if you wish to switch to Premium, Extra, or Essential at any time. You can also disable Automatic Renewal by selecting the Cancel subscription option. This will not cancel your subscription right away, but it will prevent your membership from automatically renewing on the scheduled expiration date. If you change your mind, just select reactivate subscription to once again re-enable automatic renewal. But now you know all the benefits of the all new PS Plus subscriptions and how to easily manage your membership. If you guys enjoyed this video and found it useful or at least interesting, make sure to leave a like rating, comment below to let me know what you think, and as always, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell for post notifications. I'll see you guys next week. Peace.